while others are just starting to get out of bed. Soldiers from the 3rd Squadron and 2nd Cavalry Regiment have already started preparing, preparing for the day's events. They're at the range to hone their skills and train the Afghan National Army on machine guns and mortars. Today we did a uh, range with the ANA. I taught them how to do uh, the handheld uh, mortar system, 60 millimeter, and we just showed them how to fire the round, how to properly use it, and how to make adjustments of their fire. For some of the Afghan soldiers, this was their first time firing a mortar or even seeing one up close. At first they were very nervous. I had to walk them to the steps in safety and constantly do it until they felt comfortable and confident in what they were doing. With nerves settled and confidence boosted, the Afghans are ready to practice what they've learned. They did well. When I tell them what the scenario was and what they're engaging, they, they knew exactly what fuse setting to use. They listened to the commands from their gunner from just simply hanging the fire and dropping it and putting it back on safety, you know, and just being steady with the gun overall and being calm. I think having them going through the procedures over and over and having to actually go through a live range and uh, just building that muscle memory, I think that, that when they when they do we'll go out there and, and get in contact, you know, they'll know, know what to do. They'll refer back to the training and their muscle memory. And it's training like this that may save their life or their fellow Afghan brothers' lives on the battlefield. Reporting from Kandahar Province, Afghanistan, I'm Army Sergeant Carl Greenwell.